Um, in the end, I lost just on five kilos um, in awesome. the 28-day challenge. And I've actually kept it off, which is really surprising for me. So normally I do these fad diets and different things. And as soon as you change something in it, whether you start drinking a little bit more or whatever, the weight just comes back on. So it's sort of like a drop the weight and then you gain it back and then some. Actually do it because one, you want to be a happier, healthy version of yourself. The day that you do wake up and you go, oh, okay, whatever, you, you go back to your rituals again. You sit yeah. there and you look at it and you look at the end goal and you go, I can't control everyone else around me, but I can yeah. control me and I'm, I'm going to be the happiest, healthiest version of myself. Why turn things into a negative when there's going to be a positive in everything? So yeah, that's a um, really definitely the mindset part of it has been key to the changes. And yeah. I'm really um, thankful that I stumbled across it because it's made a difference not just to me but also to my family. Restricting yourself, which I've done so many times in the past, yeah. um, you're not teaching your body anything. If you wait, you're never going to make the change. There is always something to stop you from doing it. Yeah. Um, and the night before I was going to message going, no, nah, I need another week. I can't do this. And I went, no, you have to start. So for me, it's really important to do it gradually and make sure that it is lifelong changes. And the best thing that I found is I've done the diets in the past, as I mentioned earlier. So like the shake diets, the lemon detox diets, I've done keto. But as soon as you stop that particular method, it's all over. Yeah. Um, Whereas at least now I know that it is sustainable and like you can get through it. And the exciting thing is once I start to get back into actually exercising more, I know the weight's going to keep coming off and I know I'll get more toned. In the past I go, oh, put away. Oh, it doesn't matter. Just keep any more chocolate. Um, whereas now it's like, well, no, you've had a little bit of an indulge. Now time to snap back out of it and do your normal routine. I've made up smoothies, frozen in like sachet things in the freezer so yeah. before I go to work, I just grab one of them out. They've got protein, banana, berries, almond milk in them. Grab them. They defrost on my desk while I'm working. And then by lunchtime, they're ready to have, um, or throughout the day, I can sip on them as I go and they're staying cold. Any frittata slices. So again, you've got your eggs and your veggies in there, ready to go. So there's no excuses for eating crap. Just set yourself a goal. All right, I'm going to do three exercises plus this week. And you know that you have to get them done. And overnight, as you're um, finishing off your see what you eat diary and going through for the day and doing your gratitudes, you sort of go, oh, sugar, I haven't done my exercise. Smash it out because you know that you, you need to get it done. As I was doing the home-based exercises, um, the video showed me what I could do. So yeah. you'd go through, look at them all before, you are plug in what you're going to do on what days. And then as you got to the day, you just do a refresher over that course again and go, oh, that's how I'm meant to be doing this particular exercise. So there's no excuses of not exercising because you've got children. You can incorporate them in there. A lovely bunch of ladies, like nothing was ever an issue. And you would, the first couple of days, you're like, oh, I don't want to ask this question. I don't want to seem silly. And then someone else would ask them like, oh, yeah, okay, we're on the same boat. And certain things like Christmas, um, we had a couple of parties and I found dresses in my wardrobe that didn't fit previously. Yeah. So I'm so excited for the next few months and how much yeah. more I can lose and how much better I'll be um, toned. And I think even with the weight loss, it's not necessarily about that. Yeah. It's how your body feels. Once you're in this frame of mind and you feel much better about yourself, you don't want to get back to where you were.